this week so yeah so this is a little bit behind the scenes of me creating a scavenger hunt all right bye hey guys so i'm driving back from the grocery store I just picked up a few items for the ramen making night um, some confetti some decorations and the ramen bowls and a little bit extra stuff um, just to start working on the boxes that will be shipped out later on this week Alright, hey guys, so this is me getting ready for our ramen making night that my nonprofit is having. Um, so basically, I'm just getting ramen, a drink, and some chopsticks, and I'm putting that together in different boxes for each mentor and mentee in our nonprofit. Um, it is a mentorship program that we are having. And this is some behind the scenes of what goes into it. So check it out. And also follow Yes to Invest on Instagram um, to support.
say the least. It was a long day with these kids and um, listen, it was photo day. It was just a lot and tonight I have overnight so like it's a long week. It's really a long week but tomorrow's Friday so we're almost done. Um, but yeah, so this is me after work, working in a eight-hour shift at a daycare center as a teacher assistant, and that's it. If you guys have any video ideas that you guys would like for me to do next, feel free to let me know. Hey guys, today is Saturday. What's today's date? September 30th. And we are about to walk into Home Depot to buy some keys. And it's a faith move where we're trying to buy some keys to basically, um, how do you say, it? walk into our purpose or exactly. walk into what we want to happen for our lives. So we want investments, we want property, we want generational wealth. And this is one of the first steps that we're taking mm -hmm. to solidify and to trust on God. Mm -hmm. um, so this is a big trust move that's saying that we're going to basically have our own property, yeah. have our keys and yeah. And, and move by faith. Um, mm -hmm. It reminds me of, <clears throat> there's these two twins and actually, she believed that God promised her um, b kids, but she was dealing with infertility. And by faith, she bought two, like, of uh, the baby outfits, baby onesies or whatever. Mm -hmm. And it's just, like, in in the midst of, like, what looks, like, impossible or what looks, like, can't happen based on where you come from, based on the money you have in the bank, based on family situations, you think that certain things can't happen. But then you confuse the enemy when you operate in faith. So, like, we are operating in faith. Because there's so many things that we're going through that one day we will mention yes. in our testimony, testimony and in our full story. But there's a lot of things that we've been attacked with that we've been going through that by faith it doesn't make sense for us to own properties it doesn't make sense for us to be investors it doesn't make sense for us to be millionaires but we're moving by faith and we are going to home depot today to purchase keys and to remind ourselves every single day that there's a promise in store for us and it will ultimately give glory to god as well so and i encourage you guys if you're also thinking about doing something for yourself making like life change moves like go ahead and do it and it could be a small thing that might seem like <laughs> when it's really it tiny. Cool. Yeah. Or, yeah. And, but it could really be something that changes your life for the better. So go ahead. You walk by faith today. And yeah, follow along for this journey. It's only the beginning. And better things to come. Amen. Bye, guys. Peace. <laughs> Because it's a house, period. 
So this will be us, homeowners, home investors, property owners, period, all of that and beyond. All right, bye.